No, man, it's good. It. it's good. All right, all right. Click, click, clicking right along here for our slow burn. See, this is why we call it slow burn, Alex. You know, we take our time through this rapid fire. Yes, and uh, culture or productivity? Culture or productivity? What's more important? Culture. Culture. Now, that might seemingly go against some of the other answers that I gave earlier, but I, I feel like, again, when you're tra- trying to create an environment where people can be great, I think you have to have the right culture in order for people to want to perform at their best. Um, when you talk about a, co- a culture of excellence, a culture of um, treating people the right way, the culture just, and, and you guys know, our tenure or our mix of employment from a Chick-fil-A standpoint, when you're talking about, um, and, and, and and to put a, a pin in this, our workspaces are the, are the most multi-generational than they have, than they ever been. So creating a culture to where the 16 year old can work with the 30 year old and can work with the 40 and 50 year old all on the same shift, those 36 people just have different levels of experience, different level of background. And I think it's important for us to create a culture that's accepting to all of those individuals and for all those people to thrive. So I would pick culture over productivity. I think when you have a great culture where people want to give 110% just rather than giving 70, you will organically be more uh, productive if the culture's right.